Hey folks here live on, well live this will be recorded, but uh, this is, I'm at Art Arc right now. We're doing some pickup shots so that we can put together that Art Arc video I mentioned. Uh, the more the merrier art show, the more the merrier three actually. Um, it was 40 local artists and all of their works were under $200 and it was a very fun show. Uh, all kinds of stuff. We actually bought two pieces. Got these cute little uh, strawberry earrings for Alicia and then this cool um, sculpture from Wesley Wright. Go to Wesley, is it? I don't know if the website's Wesley T. Wright, W R I G H T, or just WesleyWright.com. Check them both. When you see cool sculptures, you'll know you're there. So I'm waiting for art to show up so we can uh, get this going. So that's the sign. That's what it looks like. Let's see. I have to put on my shades because it's really bright. But let me get out on the road. And you can see what the place looks like. I don't know if you can see that very well. But that's the Art Art Gallery. And then right directly behind us here, I don't know if you can see that green building. That is the foundry. Or the back of the foundry, rather. So it's kind of cool. And then there's a little park right here. So I'm just going to take you guys with me and walk around. So today we're shooting uh, Valerie's uh, introduction and you know, hi I'm Valerie, I'm the curator of this wonderful gallery. Um, that's pretty cool. I had a pretty cool day. Had my art class. We were learning about Mesopotamia. You know, all the Babylon, Sumer, Assyria, all that. Uh, Fertile Crescent. Some of the mythology. Um, really cool stuff, the ziggurats. Uh, I definitely see the thread of meaning that my instructor has for us um, as far as the significant of the arts. It's as much a history class as it is an arts history class. Um, heavy on the history. But I'm loving it. Loving it. Um, see my shirt there? My friend Sam got me this. And of course every time I wear it somebody asks me if I'm gay. I'll, I don't I don't fill them in, I just say I'm a people person. And they go, oh, okay. <laughs> um, so I had, had my art class and then I headed to my Sacred Heart Shift, which was pretty awesome because Alicia had sent me some uh, uh, information about a free dental clinic coming up. Um, why that guy had to honk, I don't know. Oh, he's honking to his friends. Cancel. Um, free May 18th and 19th is free, the, the Dental Association Foundation or something, they're giving a free uh, dental clinic those days. They're looking to serve a, over 2,000 people starting at 5 a.m. They're going to do everything from fillings to extractions and limited a few partials for front teeth. That's awesome. Just imagine if you're down on your luck or whatever and you're missing your front teeth because I am so vain. Seriously, if I lost my front teeth, I wouldn't go out of the house. Sad to say, but that's just the way it is. I chipped my tooth here once. Uh, and my teeth actually used to be, this one used to be longer. But I was singing in a band, band practice. And uh, we were doing break on through to the other side. Break on through, oh yeah. And then it's all instrumental. And then the part when it goes week to week, day to day, hour to hour, arms are strange, deep and wide, break on through. So that part when it's all week to week, I pulled the microphone up, hit myself in the mouth, chipped the tooth, and I felt it, and it felt like it chipped to about here. And I'm so vain, I tried to, I'm like, stop the music, stop! And they weren't listening, they totally ignored me. So I went outside, and you know, my stomach got cold, I was freaking out, I'm like, great, now I'm the dude with the chipped tooth. Oh yeah, you know, Duncan, yeah, the guy with the chipped tooth, oh yeah, him! So, you know, I know I'm vain, and there are worse things, but that's, that's what, what it was. But anyway, anyway, going to make those buttons soon for a select few of you. It's going to be a special prize for dedicated watchers. But it just made my teeth even, so that worked out. Uh, and then after Sacred Heart, I went home and did some yard work and uh, some dishes, like a good guy. So, Wednesday, tomorrow's Thursday. And uh, I'll talk to you guys then. Word.